Hey, what's up, guys? It's Wolfenstein. We're back, uh, you know, doing our thing, playing uh, out there, the Omega Edition. And we are trying to get iron and other things. Uh, hang on to that one. Let's see how we doing. We'll use all the, the uh, hydrogen. And a little bit of Arcanium, since we'll go to a, uh, I'll split this and use some of it. Yeah, and then we'll go to a, oh, I gotta take off. I keep hitting that button, trying to be the solar system, we can't do that until you take off. Uh, I think I went to that one last time, so we'll go to this one. Yeah, I heard a hurl, a hurl, a hurl, a hurl, I heard a hole. For a hole, a little bit. Got quite a bit of hydrogen out of it. Um, hmm. I'll ditch that. Launch another pro. Well, we'll use a little bit of our hydrogen and then launch another one. Make the best use out of our resources. Okay, yeah. Okay. Hopefully we can find enough, uh, find us with lots of, uh, <laughs> iron, because we are running a little low. It is so large, for the first, I thought it to be some sort of strange polygonal moon, but in fact this was a ship. The carcass of this colossal spacecraft is so big that my ship could easily fly through any of its cross passages. Most definitely, the ship was built by a race of giant deities. Dead deities, the vessel appears to be ruined and deserted. Okay, we'll investigate. Uh, we fly through the ship, the light inside the cockpit projects strange shadows on the titanic corridors. The heart of the vessel I have found in an intact module of unknown origin. But its proportions are so immersed, immense that I cannot take it with me. I study from it from all angles to try and reproduce it later, but I, my scurry accelerators disturb the delicate balance of this place, and the ship's construction starts to crumble, falling and crapping its head, hit my hole, blah blah blah, okay. And our ship took a little bit of damage, that fucking sucks, and we got a new technology. Cow stasis. This module al alternates, alters the flow of time around the ship. This works only when the ship is in the pocket of the universe created by the space folder. We can jump much further now. Okay, well, that can be used a little bit useful, but uh, not enough um, shit for it. Probably because I tossed all of it. <laughs> we use the last of this. Hope to god nothing gets damaged, otherwise we're pretty much dead in the water. <laughs> one that's a little bit bigger. It'd be pretty nice right about now. Hard alert again. I was adjusting the pressure in the O2 line, then suddenly I couldn't bring myself to push the lever. Something in my mind stopped me. And I looked closely at the lever, then I realized I was in the airlock about to throw myself into the cosmos. Wow. <laughs> Crazy. That's really cool. And... Fill up all the other stuff. Make a little space. Hopefully, hopefully we can get some iron. There's, there's some bunches of... I got some thorium. That's nice. So I could make that one device now. If I so choose. Fill up on this since next time we drill it'll use a little bit of it. And I guess I will. Yeah, go ahead and craft this. And I guess I'll toss this because we need the space. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else do I want to make eventually? Oh, I know what to hang on to. 
Yeah, I'll go and toss the cobalt, because we don't need that. It's not really doing us any good. So I don't intend on making any of those. Go and drop the copper. Nothing to really use that on. As far as I know right now. <laughs> um, I think it's plutonium, if I know right. And we don't really need that, but we'll hang on to it just because. Okay. Iron, that's good. Silicone. Uh, toss that there. Do that to you just because. Just in case we need it. Alright, we can come across another garden planet. So now that I've tossed everything, I don't have. Uh, any oxygen just sitting around anymore. Uh, we should use strange radio transmission, hoping for the best. Charge, change my route to track it. Red herring, it was just an electromagnetic burst, and from a small, small star. Damn. <laughs> Lost a little bit of fuel, that's alright. Uh, sweet garden planet, just in time. Shit we call oxygen. <laughs> wow, that is fucking creepy. Um, we something something. God, okay, approve. Uh, he wants to trade. I'll give him some of that shit. Seems to like it. Okay, we got another Omega element. So that's nice. So we can use that. And I keep getting text messages. Uh, learn solar sails. It's pretty useful for uh, interplanetary travel, I think. A few new words: life, death, and hydrogen. Okay. Let's see. Let's that. Make some more space. Either use the iron, or can use the uh, omega element. So I need one of the two to repair things just in case something breaks that I need. So use the iron, and then I suppose I'll do some drilling. So kind of carbon, that's copper, and oxygen. Grab the oxygen, and leave everything else. Well, I got a good bit of hydrogen out of it. Gonna use most of it and then do another probe. And of course, I broke the probe. Oh, no, I don't want to drop that. Oh, I thought I could use this to repair things. Adjusting myself in my chair. Okay. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess I, I can use it to, rep uh, to repair any broken system, but I guess not. <laughs> okay. sucks. <laughs> Apparently I can't repair whatever without a, um, without iron. That's kind of terrible. Um, let's see. I won't travel too far, just whatever's closest. Might have some iron. I'm dizzy, the stars too bright, then I close my eyes, I see through them, my eyelids. Weird. Uh, three garden planets. Okay. Um, no matter which one I go to, it'll hurt my hole a little bit. 
to land. Yeah. So do that. Refill oxygen. Counter to peoples. a waste of a little bit of fuel and oxygen, but eh, well. Probably shouldn't have traveled quite so far, trying to conserve some fuel. Uh, mm -hmm. Wow, another thing broke. So that's cool. <laughs> that I could fix with the Half of it. Fill up on this fuel. That was weird. I don't know what just happened. <laughs> Hopefully, I used that oxygen. I wasn't really paying attention. found the thing. We ran from Earth, blah blah blah, we're watching you. Yeah, this is the one that we did find. Or the one that I did go to. We'll create a gravitational well generator now. Uh, my phone is going off. I need to turn that on silent. There we go. <laughs> okay. Gravitational well generator. Just making it so we can jump to even further ones. 
course, we're out of copper because I tossed it. We're out of uh, thorium, I think it is. No, I don't remember. But we tossed that to you. Because <laughs> we're bad. Lands, we can get some oxygen. <laughs> Looking at the environment, it doesn't look like a place where there'd be oxygen. But okay. Symmetrical pyramid. Uh, I stole some shit. Planetary expander. What's that one do? This module is attached to the standard drill device. Okay, so that helps our drill. Of course, we don't have copper, so we can't do that. That's alright. At least we have to move. Finally, <laughs> the only one that I made a comment on the very beginning produced a bunch of iron. But after that, I have no more weapons I just now. Yeah, we got some of this stuff. Uh, yeah, Thor, I was right. <laughs> I'm not just a tard. Hooray, I'm not just a tard. Okay. So I think. I create this neat cover. I just need copper to make some more stuff. Um, I'm, tired. I'm desperate to find another ship. Uh, bigger storage space is weird. We have so little. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll toss that. There's nothing to use it with. perched on my nose, fall out of my bed, bed to slam my head on the ceiling. Uh, curse and howl in pain, hunting for the beast. I found the spot hiding on the ship computers, but a whole colony of these pests that are chewing on the cabling aren't cosmic rays and black holes enough. What am I gonna do about these things? Use solder iron. Uh, bring them out with the iron. Incinerated the nest, I wipe my hands clean, not with satisfaction, and then I notice that I've melted through this cabling. Yeah. <laughs> you done fucked up. Forgot about house stasis. Well, it's alright, because I wasn't really planning on making that anyways, since we don't have a whole lot of space in the hole to uh, get right now. Playing it, see if we can't get some more iron out of it. accidentally toss that. Yeah, that's what that does. <laughs> you can do that at tossing it. Whatever permanent 
No, it doesn't. That's weird. I guess if you do it while you're in the middle of refueling or whatever, it just tosses it. <laughs> That's what happened to that oxygen I tried to use earlier. Blasted by an electromagnetic tsunami. I didn't pay attention to it, but it could have been radio or TV waves. I would have liked to watch an alien TV show. Okay. somehow <laughs> repaired my hull. What an unpleasant irony. So we, uh, deep space, or a huge white space whale. <laughs> That's interesting. It's not what I wanted to find. It cost me nine to make it there. Nine to there. Eleven to get to that one. So I guess we'll go to the yellow door if those ones tend to appeal to me a little bit more. I have grown younger, I touched the alloy in the space folder, and my hand was purged of all sign of middle age as if I were a young man unchanged by the flow of time. Interesting. <laughs> and over here, we want oxygen before we, you know, die. Let's see what they give us. seem to like it, you fucker! <laughs> I was your friend! Oh, oh no! So we try, to <laughs> we try to fuel up off of this. Sun will die. Not looking good. 13 to get to there. Oh, I do. I do have a tiny bit of hydrogen, just enough to make it there. Okay. Thank God. <laughs> yeah, I got a little bit out of it. Still desperately in need of more. Just enough to make it either one of those planets. Savannah grass caressed by the wind, which, good grief, an enormous hairy beast, a ten-armed gorilla as big as a house, <laughs> runs like hell towards me. I'd better get back to my ship. The creature grasps my ship and effortlessly lifts it up. Oh god, it snaps off the nose of my ship. Uh, like if it was peeling a giant banana and starts chewing it. Wow. <laughs> 
drop some iron. I drop a ton of iron on board. The beast drops my ship. Its attention is caught by the new piece of sugar. My ship hits the ground and I lose breath, but desperation forts me, forces me up to stand up and start the engines. Finally we get away. Leaving the creature half burned. Wow, we're assholes. supplies the entire time and for whatever reason never finding another sh another ship to exchange but uh, we'll call it there and I'll see you guys next time bye bye